Hey, hey, today we are going to learn three tricks to learn things faster and remember them for longer. Whether you have test coming up, an interview or something you have been trying to learn for quite some time which you need at work. Now remember, these are not different processes or tools for learning. Instead, they are tricks to train your mind or hack your mind to get things done. First one, study at night. Yes, you heard it right. Study at night. Now, contrary to the popular belief that we must get up early study when our mind is fresh, I'm suggesting study at night before your night routine and before you go to sleep. Why? Our brain has two kinds of memory. First is short-term memory. Whenever we read something, we remember it for short-term. And what happens as a result is throughout the day when you learn different things, you remember different things, you tend to forget them. Now, studying late at night, what the benefit it brings is once you learn it, you do your routine, you're not going to stuff anything to your mind anymore and you sleep over it. As a result, your mind converts this from short-term memory to long-term memory and hence giving it a place in your brain for longer time. Try this next time. Second one, linking it with emotion, which means learning when you are stressed. Again, contrary to the practice you have been taught, right? Now, our brain or our mind and body reacts very strongly to emotions, whether it's sadness, happiness, excitement, grief or stress. Now, stress is one of the most strongest emotion for the mind as well as body. As a result, whenever you are stressed, let's say you had a tough day, you had a tough time with your friends or you're having a tough time with family, you went for a workout and your body is stressed out. That's when you should go and start learning or learn something you have been struggling to do. What your mind will do is link what you have studied to that emotion, which means even in long run, whenever you are in stress or you need to remember it before the test or an interview, what you studied will come back to you. So again, a very smart trick. Learn things which you have been struggling to learn when you are stressed. Third one, repetition of patterns. Now, this is very important. From childhood, whenever we learn something, we have been told, repeat it or revise it. And, we do, and what we generally do is we study something, study just to the thing, revise it, maybe in four or five hours, sleep over it, you know, take our good night, sleep before the exam and then revise everything again. This does not help us remember what we have learned because what we are doing is we are reading the same thing again. So if your mind forgot it before, because it got other information and it could not connect it, your mind is probably going to forget it again. So what you should do is repeat or revise the pattern. So for example, China is in east of Asia. Now you need to remember this. Where is China? Next, when you read, remember China is in northeast of Asia or northeast of India. China comes comes in west of USA. So once you go to California, go to west coast. After that, when you enter Asia, you get China. You remember China is a southeastern country and then start linking it with other Chinese country. Now, when you repeat this pattern of information, your mind connects the answer, which is, you know, answer to the question, which is where is China, to different patterns. And as a result, it can store the memory for longer and link it to other information sources you have. So, third one, revise or repeat patterns, different patterns which reach the same solution and not the same answer again and again. So, next time, whenever you have to study something, you're preparing for your exam, you're preparing for your interview, or you just need to get something right for your work, try these three tricks and I can tell you, you will succeed. Till then, stay tuned for the next session. Have a good time learning. Cheers.